One way to build more thoracic extension is to perform pails and rails out of an elevated prayer position. For this, you'll need something like a, a bench if you're at the gym, a coffee table, in this case an ottoman, or something of similar height. So the setup is elbows on the edge of the bench, knees back behind the hips, hands clasped together, and we're going to drop the head down between our biceps. Now, there's a couple things you can do with your head here depending on your preference. Uh, you can let your head hang in front of the bench, down toward the floor, but uh, it's also, some people find it more comfortable if you just rest your forehead on whatever it is that you're propping your elbows on. So here, we can either keep our hands above our elbows or for a slightly more aggressive stretch, we're gonna lay our hands all the way back toward the base of our neck. Um, either way, the rest is the same, so I'm gonna keep my hands up. And what I'm trying to do is create extension in my upper back. So I want to draw my chest toward the ground to create this stretch. And the goal here is really to open the space between ribs and collarbones. To perform your pails effort, simply drive your elbows down into the bench as if you were going to flex your upper spine like so. So that's your intention, but no motion should occur. You're just going to stay down and press those elbows down for pails. For rails, you want to draw your chest deeper. Now, as we're trying to pull our chest down, what we're looking to feel is contractions across the entirety of our upper back which encourages us to extend that upper back more. As with all pails and rails, when you're done the rails, stay down in position, rest, and then repeat for the desired number of repetitions.